It's time for some chaos here on MTG Unpacked, the final two chaos mystery boxes for September 2019. And we have Tezzeret here to do the pack blessings. So hopefully he will get us the crazy pulls we're looking for, the patrons today. We have Richard Corwin, he's back again. And Ink Junkie 101, same with him. So let's move Tezzeret aside. We will roll one through three or four through six. And that will be the one Richard gets. And then the other one will be for Ink Junkie 101. Let's roll it. So we get a three, so that will go to Richard. And this one for Ink Junkie 101. Okay, let's get cracking here. So these things are my vision for how a Chaos Mystery Box should be. Stuff full of goodness. And let's see what we've got today. We have Modern Horizons 2011 Corset, Aether Revolt. We've got a Gorak Cooler of Beasts foil. We'll take a look at that in a moment. Kaladesh, two packs of that, and War of the Spark. So this is how we do the pack blessings. And let's arrange things like so. Okay, and we will look at the foil here for Richard. So this is from M14. We have Garrick, Caller of Beasts. Planeswalker Garrick, four loyalty for six. His plus one. Reveal the top five cards of your library. Put all creature cards revealed this way into your hand and the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. It's minus three. You may put a green creature card from your hand onto the battlefield and minus seven. You get an emblem with whenever you cast a creature spell. You may search your library for a creature card, put it onto the battlefield, then shuffle your library. Some nice foiling on that one. And he is back in Throne of Eldraine, so it'll be good to see Gurk again. Okay, let's get cracking here. War of the Spark. So Richard did pretty well the other day with his previous video. Let's see if we can do even better. We start off with a Pouncing Lynx and instantly the patrons get the Rares, Mythics, Foils and anything over a buck. Stealth Mission, Honor the God Pharaoh, Rising Populace, Lazatep Behemoth, Crunch Wrangler, Nahiri's Stoneblades, Temio's Epiphany, Bane Hound, Trusted Pegasus, Uncommon's Domri's Ambush, Devouring Hellion, Nahiri Storm of Stone, so I'll put Planeswalkers in as well, and commence the end game is the rare. Instant for six, this spell can't be counted. Draw two cards then, amass X, where X is the number of cards in your hand. So you put X plus one plus one counters on an army you control. If you don't control one, create a zero zero black zombie army creature token first. And an island and a wolf token. Okay, onward, 2011 core set, and these packs are very difficult to open, I keep forgetting scissors, should probably have them, oh, there's Liliana, hi Liliana, how you going, ah, what is happening here, you've seen it here first people, I'm having trouble opening packs, okay, 2011 core set, we have Spined Worm, Canyon Minotaur, Assassinate, Pacifism, Naturalize, Arc Runner, Mind Rot, that's pretty cool, Maritime Guard, Dryad's Favor, Solemn Offering, and Uncommons Condemn, Ornithopter, Back to Nature, and the rare is Reverberate, Instant for two, Copy Target, Instant or Sorcery Spell, you may choose new targets for the copy. And an island, and what is this? Uh, tips and tricks, parts of the turn. Okay, so if you were ever curious about that, next we have Kaladesh looking for those lorry cards. The inventions still have not pulled any in a long time. We have Avery Mechanic, Failed Inspection, Cathartic Reunion, Mind Rot. Oh, again, okay. Thriving Rhino, Renegade Freighter, Rush of Vitality, World Fast Monitor, Welding Sparks, Larger Than Life, and Uncommon's Underhanded Designs, Whirler Virtuoso, Restoration Gearsmith, and a Mythic Combustible Gear Hulk, Artifact Creature Construct 664, 6 mana with First Strike, when it enters the battlefield, target opponent may have you draw three cards if the player doesn't put the top three cards of your library into your graveyard. 
Then combustible gear Hulk deals damage to that player equal to the total converted mana cost of those cards. Who is a fan of the gear Hulks from back in the day? Leave it out in the comments. Again, Ireland and a servo. Okay, so first mythic. Actually, there's two mythics if we count the Garrett there. Moving right along, Aether Revolt. Looking for inventions here as well. We have Aether Chaser. Shipwreck Moray. Caught in the Brights. Unbridled Growth. Fourth Bridge Prowler, Countless Gears, Renegade, Implement of Combustion, Verdant Automaton, Ice Over, and Uncommon's Gonti's Machinations, Morphous Revolutionary, Illusionist Stratagem, and another Mythic, Aetherwind Basker, Creature Lizard 7747 Mana, Whoa, with Trample, when he enters the battlefield, or oh, whenever he enters battlefield or attacks, you get one energy, you can pay one energy and he gets plus one plus one until end of turn. That is a super lizard and these guys foil invigorated rampage. We've got the gremlins and a mountain and a servo token. Okay, back to Kaladesh. So doing rather nicely here for Richard. A couple of mythics already. Not high-end mythics, but there is still time. We have an Aether Theorist, Spireside Infiltrator, Skyswall Harrier, Dramatic Reversal, Dakara Scavenger, Takedown, Foundry Screecher, Glint Sleeve Artisan, Prakada Pillarbug, Accomplished Automaton, and Uncommon's Longfin Skywhale, Ballista Charger, Snare Thopter, and the rare is Aether Squall, Ancient Creature Leviathan, 6-6 six, six for 7, with flying at the beginning of your upkeep, you get three energy, you pay. What on earth is that? Eight energy, return all other creatures to their owner's hands, activate this ability only any time you could cast a sorcery. Okay, that's pretty expensive. And a mountain and a thopter token. Okay, final pack, Modern Horizons. Will we continue this streak here for Richard? We shall see. We start off with a zombie token. We get a sword, is it Sword of Truth and Justice, uh, Sinew and Steel, I always get them mixed up. Snow-Covered Mountain and the rare, oh no 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 no, we get a foil, I kite, and the rare, okay here we go. Scrapyard Recombiner, so artifact creature construct 0-0 for 3, as modular 2, so it enters the battlefield with 2 plus 1 plus 1 counters on it, when it dies you may put its plus 1 plus 1 counters on target artifact creature. You can tap second artifact, search your library for a construct card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Okay, so not the craziest pull there, and Uncommon's Feaster of Fools, Webweaver Changeling, Battle Screech, and the Commons Venomous Changeling, Orcish Hellraiser, Fountain of Icor, Silumgar Scavenger, that is the most revolting zombie bird I've ever seen. Gluttonous Slug, yes! Frostwaller. Moonblade Shinobi, Bugarden Dragonheart, and Stirring Address. Okay, so that is it here for Richard. Thank you for being a patron, sir. We'll tuck all this away for you and move on to Ink Junkie 101. Hopefully that'll fit. Yes, okay. Ink Junkie 101, let's dig into it and see if Tezzeret can get us some juicy goodness. Okay, what are the packs we have? War of the Spark, Kaladesh, Aether Revolt. Oh, I was wondering when we'd find this one. Mythic Edition, Tezzeret, Agent of Bolas. We'll take a look at that in a moment. Of course, at 2019, two of those, and Modern Horizons. Let's do the pack blessing like so. And let's see, Modern Horizons here. We'll go something like this. And we'll eat our bland vegetables first, like always. Okay, let's take a look at this thing. I have not handled too many of these, but I was very excited about including them in the Chaos Boxes. So, Tezzeret, Agent of Bolas, Legendary Planeswalker, Tezzeret, Mythic. Three loyalty for four, his plus one. Look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal an artifact card from among them. Put it into your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Is minus one. Target artifact becomes an artifact creature with base power and toughness 
what is that, 5-5, five, five, and his minus 4 target player loses X life and you gain X life, where X is twice the number of artifacts you control. Fantastic foiling there. All right, so that is a great pull already for Ink Junkie 101. I think he's pretty much uh, got his money back just with that card. Okay, Corset 2019. Let's dig in here. And the patrons, once again, rares, methods, foils, anything over a buck, along with planeswalkers. We have Catalyst Elemental, Rustwing Falcon, Disperse, Daggerback Basilisk, Duress, Spark Tongue Dragon, Wall of Vines, Luminous Bonds, Marauder's Axe, Uncommon's Bone to Ash, Poison Tip Archer, Ajani's Pride Mate, and the rare is Sarkhan's Unsealing Enchantment for four. Whenever you cast a creature spell with power four, five, or six, Sarkhan's Unsealing deals four damage to any target. And whenever you cast a creature spell with power seven or greater, it deals four damage to each opponent and each creature and planeswalker they control. All right, and a foil goblin motivator. There you are, some extra motivation. And a planes and a goblin token. I'm going to put that in as well. Everybody needs a goblin token. 2019 again. So those vegetables weren't too bad. Let's see how we do. Knight's Pledge, Anticipate. On oh, okay, Ogre. Macabre Waltz, Talons of Wildwood. Wall of Mist, Rabid Bite, Manalith, Abnormal Endurance, Ghost Form, Uncommon's Blanchwood Armor, Novice Knight, Surge Mare, and a Mythic Ajani, Adversary of Tyrants. Here he is, Legendary Planeswalker Ajani, 4 loyalty for 4, he's plus 1, put a plus 1, plus 1 counter on each of up to 2 target creatures, minus 2, return target creature card, with convert mana cost 2 or less from your graveyard to the battlefield. Is minus seven, you get an emblem with at the beginning of your end step. Create three one one white cat creature tokens with lifelink. We are doing very nicely on the mythic tally today. We get a planes and a dragon token. Okay, on to Aether Revolt. We have Dawn Feather Eagle, Embral Gear Smasher, Leave in the Dust, Decommission. Resourceful Return, Druid of the Cowl, Augmenting Automaton, Aether Inspector, Implement of Ferocity, Implement of Examination, Uncommon's World Fast Engineer, Gremlin Infestation, Thopter Arrest, and the rare is Battle at the Bridge. It's a sorcery for X and a black, has Improvise, and Target Creature gets minus X, minus X until end of turn, you gain X life. And I think that's Tezzeret there again. And a Swamp, and a Gremlin token. Okay, onward to Kaladesh. Knight's Bridge Patrol, High Tide Hermit, Cow Prowler, Live Fast, Prophetic Prism, Gear Seeker Serpent, Consulate Skygate, Commencement of Festivities, Impeccable Timing, Fire Forger's Puzzle Knot, and Uncommon's Imperial Voyager, Morphist Doorbuster, Elegant Edgecrafters, and the rare is Lost Legacy. This one's a good one from back in the day. Sorcery for three. Name a non artifact, non land card search, target player's graveyard hand and library for any number of cards with that name and exile them. That player shuffles his or her library, then draws a card for each card exiled from hand this way. That's almost a must if you're uh, playing with Rat Colony or something like that. And a Planes and a Servo token. Okay, onward to War of the Spark. And we start off here with Gideon's Sacrifice. Poor Gideon, Teferi's Time Twist, Grim Initiate, Snare Spinner, Toll of the Invasion, Devriel's Shadow Fugue, Wanderer's Strike, Relentless Advance, Enforcer Griffin. Jaya's Greeting, hello there! She's doing a little bit of cooking. Watley's Raptor, first the Uncommons, Bleeding Edge, Flux Channeler, and Nissa who shakes the world. Another great Planeswalker. Legendary Planeswalker Nissa, five loyalty for five. Whenever you tap a forest for matter, add an additional green. Her plus one put three. Plus one plus one counters up to one target. Non-creature land you control. Untap it. Becomes a zero zero elemental creature with vigilance and haste that's still a land. Her minus eight. You get an emblem with lands you control, have indestructible, search your library for any number of forest cards, put them onto the battlefield, tapped, then shuffle your library. Okay, there, there we go, very cool. Forest 
And a zombie army. So Ink Junkie 101 doing really nicely today. And final pack, Modern Horizons. See if we can do even better this time. Okay, what do we got today? That's a non-foil shapeshifter. And get the flying carpet dude. Snow covered planes and you know the drill people. We're gonna build the suspense here. Okay, no foil. We have a Crusan Tusker. Return from Extinction Wind Cooler Avon. Pyrophobia. Segovian Angel, Ransack the Lab, Bellowing Elk, Imposter of the Sixth Pride, Phantom Ninja, and Reckless Charge. Okay, so nothing crazy there. Moving on to the Uncommons. We have First Slivers Chosen, Goblin Oriflam, and Talisman of Hierarchy. Okay. And finally, the rare. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. It is Force of Virtue. Enchantment for four. If it's not your turn, you may exile a white card from your hand rather than pay this spell's mana cost. It has flash. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one. All right, there we are. Thank you for being a patron, Ink Junkie 101. Thanks for watching and have a great day.